Welcome to this week's game. It's David from Be Skill Be Fit. This game is called Crows and Cranes. So Crows and Cranes is a reaction and acceleration game. So we've set up an area. We've got two big yellow cones marking in the middle there, two big red cones marking in the middle. So we've got partners standing opposite each other. Opposite each other. So the line on this side, the yellow line, we call them the crows. The red line, they are called the cranes. So when we call out crows, crows have to turn, sprint back to the end of the square here without being touched by their partners. Now if we call cranes, cranes have to turn, sprint to the other end without being touched by the crows. So it's a really good reaction acceleration game. So, crows! Okay, so you gotta turn, you gotta move quick, you gotta react, and your partner's gotta try and chase you. Okay, so if your partner gets back to the line without being touched, then they get a point. If you touch your partner, then you get the point, and you keep score and see how we go. Okay, crows! Okay, so they've gotta be thinking, they've gotta be ready to react. Remember, if we call crows, crows are running, cranes are chasing. If we call cranes, cranes are running, crows are chasing. Great! Okay, then we can change it up. So we can change up our start position. So we can turn so that we are facing away from our partner. Put our hands on our head. Cross our feet. We can mix it up and keep continually change that. Great! Some positions are easier to get out of and react quickly from than some of the other positions. We can face each other, we can squat down, put our hands on our toes. We do need to be careful of this one that they don't run into each other. Crew! <laughs> and then the other thing that we can do, if you find that someone is catching someone all the time or they're not getting away, we want to mix it around and change partners so you can mix that up so we can keep all the kids engaged, keep it nice and fair so that they're chasing someone that's getting an equal chance of getting away and also being caught. Okay, so you just need to remind them when people change that. Remember, yellow line is the crows, red line is the crane. Crane! Okay, so it's a great reaction acceleration game. Make sure you've got enough space, spread it out sideways so lots of space for the kids to turn, run, and you want to make it long enough so that the kids have got time to get up to speed and a little bit of time so the chaser can try and cover the distance and get there and tag them. Hope you enjoy Crows and Cranes. Have fun. We'll see you next time. Cranes! Thank <laughs> you.